A few weeks ago, the wonderful forum here was transformed into one big giant moon. And now we've gone even beyond that to the world above, to the virtual world. And here at the Norwich Gaming Festival, there is so much going on, you won't believe it. Come and have a look. about gaming, I mean, um, when I hear that word, I often think, are you not encouraging young people to perhaps take something up um, that's not going to be of any great value to well, later on in it's, it's obviously a, a, a point of view that we're very careful to, to acknowledge at the festival. We have um, the university are our main partner, so we partner with them because we're trying to show that the skills that you learn when you want to make games are transferable skills, so mathematics, science, these are all very important if you want to make games. Now, not everyone ends up making games, and these people that have, have these qualifications go out into the world with a very valuable set of skills in this day and age, and they end up designing software for hospitals or taking virtual reality headsets into de dementia care homes. Um, so there's all sorts of skills, and technology is in our lives everywhere, and the, the g gaming is a way to introduce and, and find a hook for the kids to engage them in things like science, education, problem solving, all valuable elements to, to any game designer. I am Agent NGF 2017, this is my passport and my mission, it says here, should I choose to accept it, is to collect all 10 stamps. So that's where I'm off to, first of all, number one, walk this way. mind stamping my thingy for me. Oh, that's a nice one, isn't it? Would you mind um, stamping my thing for me? I have no idea what I'm doing. Hello, excuse me, can you just do my number two, yeah, that's please? Fine. You can do it if you like. Yeah, go on, you turn around there, hang on. Hello, sorry to bother you. Could you just stamp my yeah, thing here for me? Lovely. Explain what the game is about. Yeah, so the, my video game, uh, Callum, is it's a virtual reality adventure game. Mm. So you would be exploring these floating islands, uh, hence the name Callum, uh, where, where uh, sort of like ancient time uh, alchemists uh, did their, their little experiments and stuff like that. So you, you'll be finding uh, treasures and, and treasure maps for other islands to explore. Well, congratulations. Thank Good you luck very much. with it. And uh, just one thing, I have my passport here. Oh, yeah. I'll just and could you just stamp it for me? You are, you are VR, the VR zone, zone number nine, yes. Number nine. It doesn't matter which way you do it. There we go. Well, Great. <laughs> yeah, when you have your cataract done, it's like this. And ready? Excellent. One, two, three, four, down. And whoa! <laughs> whoa. You'll never play and the piano again. <laughs> you! Hey, you stuck my thing! My passport. I don't know why I speak it like that, but it sounds right somehow. Thank you. Well, we've uh, been established for 25 years as a company, and we, we started out with music courses. And uh, more recently, our media programme has been really successful. And uh, so we, um, as part of our expansion, we're offering full games courses at levels two and three. As this is such a growing industry, the creative industries are growing, um, the, the opportunities for young people are growing, and we're becoming a very tech, technology-based society. Um, access to games is really kind of reflecting that. It feels like the right time to have a, a level three games course coming on board. It's been really, really popular. We've got lots of take up um, of new students coming in, starting to study with us in 2017. And um, basically, it's not just about being a gamer. Uh, it's about having those transferable skills, design skills, creative skills, marketing. Uh, and it's really transferable into all sorts of job roles. Well, there's a lot to see and to do here. And if you'd like to come along, it's on for one more day. So um, do get down here because, well, it really takes your breath away. Way beyond me, most of it. But I have actually got all my stamps now. So this does mean that I could go in for a competition to win a Nintendo Switch. If I knew what that was, I'd be thrilled. But I really think that this is probably more my scene. A nice game of Frogger. The only trouble is, I have no one to play with me. Fancy a game? No thanks. Oh well, Billy no mates. <laughs>